Hey guys and welcome back, it's Ben here at the Weymouth Street Massive and welcome back to another episode. Um, it's good to be out and about vlogging for you again. Um, last week, midweek, one of them got cancelled unfortunately just because of the rain, but thankfully the semi-final of the FA Vars between Corsham and Ascot is on after some earlier drama about whether or not the ground will be good enough. It is, it looks brilliant. Uh, the fans are packing in. Uh, and it's going to be an occasion and a half. I'm really looking forward to this one. Um, and if you haven't already, you know the deal. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, uh, join the channel. We are fast approaching 450 subscribers um, and we need your help to make it there. So hit that subscribe button, join the channel and help get us there. I think we're three away currently, uh, 447. So let's have three, at least three of you hit that subscribe button, join the channel. Let me know down below, would you like us to come back and watch Corsham again? Or would you like to see us go and visit Ascot at some point in the future? Let us know in the comments below. Uh, and I'll see you in just a second for my prediction. All right, it is prediction time here at Corsham, and it is Corsham Town FC versus Ascot United. They come not too far from London, uh, between London and Reading, I believe. Uh, so they had a little bit of a trip down here, but they're here. It's a semi-final of the Vars. Both teams really, really looking for the first time to ever make the final, uh, which is going to be a moment of history for either side today. But there's a semi-final, 90 minutes at least to get through. So this is going to be really, really interesting. Uh, Corsham, good form, doing well in the league. Won four of their last five games um, and are ha have been good. They're good defensively in the Vars. Um, on the other hand, Ascot United are the competition's top scorers. They put 10 past Western League uh, AEK Boko um, and could be looking to get a, a few, a grab a few more here but who knows I'm going to go I'm going to be conservative with my prediction this time not many goals I think it's going to be a cagey affair because I knew both sides know what's up for stake but I think it's going to be a 1-0 caution win with the home fans behind them it's going to be interesting it's going to be difficult but I think they can get it done I'll see you in a second for the start of this game Ascot go one ahead, probably against the run of play, but great counter. Uh, and it is half time here at the South Bank. Um, and Ascot United find themselves 1-0 up, um, possibly against the run of play of the first 30 minutes. Uh, Corsham got off to a roaring start, looked like they could have gone 2-0 up. They had two, at least two great chances. One where uh, striker number 11 came and pickpocketed the ball off the um, keeper, um, who eventually managed to get back and get a handle on it. Um, but it was a counter-attack that undid it all. Uh, simple as, uh, ball over the top, defender, tr defender tried to get a touch on it, couldn't quite, and he was away. Um, attacker Cooley putting it past the key keeper, Sam Jepson, who couldn't uh, save them that time. Um, and then they shrunk away a little bit in the last 15 minutes following the goal. Um, having said that, 
it's either side to game if they come out here and make the right changes. Uh, it's been open, it's been expansive, it's been attacking, um, which has been, made it a very interesting game. But hopefully for caution's sake, they can come out and perform like that first 20, 25 minutes. I'll see you in the second half in just a bit. Score go their second, they equalise on the line, poked in. all over here after an exceptional second half performance from Corsham who grabbed two goals looked like they could seal out a victory uh, unfortunately conceded um, in the latter stages of the half um, pokes over the line um, and in the penalty shootout the results we put a shootout um, despite some heroics from both goalkeepers uh, and also from the frame of the goal uh, it does end with Ascot United heading to Wembley and Caution's Road cut short here in the semis and what a road it's been and congratulations to both teams uh, particularly, but particularly to Caution, a local side, a Wiltshire side and they've done everyone very, very proud. Uh, if you haven't already, like and subscribe down below join the channel we're on our way to 500 subscribers and we need your help to do it so hit that subscribe button and don't miss out on any further content because we got we got some more content coming for you gonna take a little uh, some time to recover but you watch this space so subscribe i've been ben this has been the way street massive we'll see you very very soon for another video